Hey guys, welcome to the stream. This week in caps, episode 144 starts in a couple minutes. Drop a like on the video. Let us know you're here in the comments. And in the meantime, enjoy this beat. This is the music that Leon likes to uh, grab his tube sock. Hey, yo. <laughs> and get to work during <laughs> the special Leon Chen beat right here. Mom's asking. Yeta. What are you doing down there, Leon? I'm just watching views from the vault, I swear. <laughs> yeah, it's going to be a fun show, man. How's everybody's day? It's good, it's good. Glad it was Friday. Style strikes me as the kind of guy that a good day to him is like heading over to the Home Depot. We don't, we don't even have a, a Home Depot in where I live. All right, the Lowe's. Got a Walmart. That's about it. Oh, okay. It's a super Start. center, though, right? It is a super center. Yeah, yeah. of course mm -hmm. it is. Right? Mm -hmm. I can tell from looking at you. <laughs> where Started. I come from, we don't go to Walmart for our groceries. We just go there for, like, you know. <laughs> oh, hey. We, we only go to Walmart if nothing else is open. We do yeah. have an Aldi and a Kroger, too. Pretty fancy. We only go to Walmart if we want to see people wearing Snuggies as if it's an actual clothes. Oh. A piece of clothing. You guys know what I'm talking about those Snuggie things? I have mm -hmm. students that wear Snuggies for actual clothes. Never seen more sweatpants and flip-flops in my life than at a Walmart. <laughs> Walmart always reeks of depression, that's for sure. Is uh, Milo going to be on for uh, Keeper Sleepers and Weepers as well? Yes. All right. I got his, uh, his submissions. Oh, I can't wait to see these. I love when we bring new blood on the show. We get to see what they do for Keepers, uh, weepers, keepers Sleepers and Weepers. It's always fun. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. So I started a new job this week, Pierre. Yeah, my boss is an asshole. <laughs> Hopefully, he's there. <laughs> What's that? Well, his Hopefully job is there, not offered. <laughs> yeah, I'm my uh, own boss. Uh -oh. I'm not starting. Uh, I'm not starting my. Uh, I'm not full time at Toppers. I'm a man of many, uh, many jobs. Mm -hmm. Smart money don't sleep. But I'm having a fun time with Jason and Pat getting that place ready. Now we're putting an awning up on the on the store. The construction's almost done. Got the shelves coming in. Got hats arriving this week. Ooh, that's the most exciting part. Got some uh, private label apparel arriving in the next couple of days. Man, it's gonna be something. It's gonna be something. Wait until you, wait until you see the the Mott Haven boxer shorts. That's mm -hmm. exciting. Well, I made a special like tri blend Mont Haven tube sock for uh, Hezzy, Leon, mm -hmm. and anybody else who finds it necessary to. Yeah, know, we we sell we sell them in packs of one too, so you don't need to buy two. Well, hopefully, we don't, we don't have to share it. Hopefully, <laughs> that is disgusting. Share it. Ugh. <laughs> I got to spend some time with Hezzy in LA. I, I helped him get secure his hats. He was very worried. I said, Don't worry, little man. <laughs> I've got you. He looks like he's a tall fella. Is he tall? He's not that much taller than me. He's a couple of inches taller, maybe. It's about above average. Oh no, it's above average. Like yeah. you know, what's the what's the average like American? Like five nine, five, nine. five ten? Five eleven. Five eleven? Five eleven? Kids. Wow. Tall. Yeah, Much kids. Tall. The store's opening May 6th. Grand opening May 6th. 5'9. Five 5'9. Nine, five nine. Five nine. That's what I thought. I thought it was like 5'11. 5'11 is kind of tall, man. Yeah. That sounds about you know, right. Tall, then. And photo. Uh, photo's like, Hezzy is tall. Yeah, okay, man. Yeah, I know he's tall. I said he was. You're like four foot one, <laughs> photo. <laughs> I saw him. 
I was like, I, I went up the phone. I said, stand up when you're talking to me. He's like, I am standing up. <laughs> All right, you guys ready to get started here? Yeah, let's do it. All right. Let's start with the count. Oh, no. Hey everyone, welcome to The Vault, episode 144 of This Week in Caps goes right now. Uh, Jason, Leon, and Pierre, we're joined by our guests today, Hatman X, a.k.a. Milo. Uh, Bree's in the house again for the first time this year, it's been too long, and our moderator style. Hope you guys enjoy, Pierre, take it away. I want to tell you right now, style is in for some work tonight. We are working <laughs> that red-headed son of a bitch tonight. He is going to have to, he's going to have to maneuver He's going to have to change screen uh, dimensions. He's going to have to do a lot of shit tonight. So, Style, I hope you and your little Sugar King man are ready. Um, I'm ready. But listen, I'll, I want to start by introducing um, our guest here, Milo, Hatman X. He is like, uh, listen, puñeta. So, he's like teaching us some. Uh, he's teaching us some. Did I say it wrong? No, he said it well. I said, well, all right, good. I, I guess that I guess the, that, that, that time I spent in Ponce helped me. But... <laughs> You know, it's interesting. So I'm in um, I'm in New York, right? I get out of the car with Snap. I go to pay. 50% off all Domino's online. Who's doing <laughs> Was that you, Leon? God damn it, Leon. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking Leon. Leon's That's ordering funny. Domino's while we're talking. So I, <laughs> this uh, has a have have I, I want 50% off Domino's. So whoever got that coupon, send it over. <laughs> <laughs> that, was, that, was, that was an ad. That was an ad on our video. Well, we Was it? Yeah. Oh shit. Oh okay. So um, <laughs> listen, to this. fucking Leon, man, this That's guy is me. something else. It ain't me. So, so listen. So I, I get out the car in, in New York when I was with uh, Snap, right? And uh, this guy comes up to me. He's like, "Hey, man, I know you." And I'm like, "Who are you?" And he's like, "Man, I know you." I'm like, "I said, who are you?" So I'm starting to feel like a little weird, right? <laughs> and then he's like. He's like, listen, man, I know you from uh, from 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 this from the show. He's like, my my brother watches your show a lot. So I was like, your brother does, yeah. So I Facetime Milo here, right? And we're mm -hmm. talking. I'm like, hey, why don't you just come on the show? Yep, yep, yep. That's how it happened, man. Just randomness like that. So right. for those of you out there, like sometimes I don't realize like how many people know us, but like we're in L we're in L A once, right? All of us. Snap wasn't with us. It was me, Jason, and Leon, right? Chicago. And Chicago, Chicago. And we're in a random ass parking garage. And some dude drop uh stops his car. Is like uh they're like Pierre, Leon, J Jason? They're just out of freaking nowhere. It's it's just it's it's insanity. But I, I think these things always happen for a good reason. So I'm really, really excited um to have uh Milo on here with us today. Uh Milo's a big hat yeah. guy, you can tell he's got a little custom, custom hat. Miles, how, does that, how does that make you feel though? Does it does it do you do you enjoy it or do you like does it does it bother you like when people come up to you when they're shit? rolling up on us in a parking garage and saying yeah, yeah, yeah. that gets me a little <laughs> a little concerned. Yeah, you know yeah. what it is, man? It's kind of humbling to be honest with you. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So when you go out and like you know, sometimes you just realize because this is just like a hobby for us, right? And then you start to realize, wait a second, like we've actually meant something to somebody sure. beside their families. 100%. So anything we can do to bring like joy or happiness to people. I think it's I think it's good. Now I know there's gonna be moments on the show where you see it real raw. You'll see like arguments and stuff. But that's that's how things are, man. That's how friends work, right? You get into arguments one day, you're fine the next. But it's like a it's almost like a reality show, like centered around hats. You know, because <laughs> our relationships and how we talk to each other, like it's like a reality show, because it's not like rehearsed. None right. of it is. 
But um, I was so happy to meet you. And then I was really excited to offer the invitation for you to come on here. And then Leon kind of, you know, he tied the knot, so to speak. So now. <laughs> Appreciate both of you. <laughs> Yeah, so um, so Milo, we're excited to have you here, and we got Bree back, which is fantastic. Um, so you guys ready to get started? Hell yeah! Let's kill it. All right, let's do it. We want to show off the hats first. Oh yeah, we're supposed to do that first. You're right. You're 100 percent right. So why don't we start with our guest, Milo? I'm wearing a custom puñeta hat with the flag on the side, and we got the island on the back. And it's made by Nam's original. Yeah. That's his tag in there. I like it. That's fine. I need one of those. All right. Uh, Style, know? since you're the least important, how about you uh, <laughs> go next? Rocking this uh, Birdine's 15-year anniversary. Oh, I remember that one. Oh, yeah. Mm-hmm. One of my favorites. Good That's hat. That's good fun. hat. Bree, how about you? Uh, I have on the um, Rust Belt 2.0 um, oh, okay. from Lids. Good pack. Bird. Love it. Jason Mead. Uh Sneaker Town with the super fast shipping. Ooh. Same drop this afternoon and I got here tonight. So I had to put it right on my head. Nice. How about you, Leon? I guess I'm crown minded. Um, Round Rock Express. Shout out to Ace, man. One of the best in the game. Um, yeah, one of the good ones. But I'm wearing this uh this was uh, a hook to the copper. Uh, foam posits. So uh, my fitted John Jay threw this baby together, and this thing is smooth, man. Smooth, all that copper. Dude, is beautiful. He makes ugly shoes look good. <laughs> <laughs> this is a good ass hat, man. Mm-hmm. So those are the hats. How about we? Um, how about we vote on? Um... Well, I'm in the bottom row, so I don't count. So like, <laughs> what, how, how the hell did that happen? What Why don't we put? Uh, Jason, Milo, Leon, and Bree. And then um, I guess we can get started here. Now people are asking about Snap. Snap is at a casino. Um, I'm not I'm not really sure how that just randomly happens in the middle of a fucking day, but whatever. He's just there. He didn't know until about three minutes ago. So he's, yeah. but he's in the car. Took his family to the casino. Yeah. Well, don't bet on Snap tonight, all right? <laughs> all right. So, you guys ready to get started? Let's do it. Mm-hmm. All right. So, let's start here. 1515 Diallo. We have this little uh, – this this colorway is familiar for some reason. What is – what is? oh, it's like Cavaliers. It's the Guardian. Yeah. The yeah, yeah. crossover. Oh. And, yeah, and uh, Hat Club did one in this colorway a while ago Yeah. without the side patch. Yeah. You guys liking this? Are you crossovered out? Underwhelming. Thank you, Milo. That's exactly what I was thinking. I'm not crossovered out, but I don't need a Cleveland one. There's got to be good colors to cross over. Yeah, I don't like these. These 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 Cleveland the Cleveland Cavaliers colors are not like Mm -mm. spectacular. Yeah, I like how Milo described. He said underwhelming. The problem is their block C sucks. Like even if they would have swapped the logos, would nah, it's not the lo- it's not the logos, it's the colors. The colors mm-hmm. suck. I mean, I liked it when Hack Club did it. The original crossover. Listen, in in um, in all honesty, you like what almost everything ago. Hack Club has done over the it past. Was also, it was also two years ago, so maybe, you know, it's not. All right, well, true. I'm underwhelmed, just like Milo is. So let's move on to four U caps. Oof. All right, Milo and Bree, we're going to play a little game. Keep two, drop two. I'm going to start with you, Bree. Easy. Um, I'm going to keep the chrome sliding bison, and I like that UNC chrome dome. Um, dropping the socks bottom row, and probably that Chicago Bulls um, olive with the red riding. Hmm. All right. You're not on board with the rip stop nylon? <laughs> no. I'm keeping no. The, I'm keeping Kingston Indians and the Bruins. And I'm dropping the Bulls and that socks hat. You know, you guys don't like the cascading logo. The cascading huh? thing is starting to get like just everybody's doing it too much now. No, I have to say I agree with that, man. 
I like the Cleveland Guardians hat here, though. Yeah, it's uh, much better than the one we just saw. <laughs> yeah, I do like that. Yeah, and everyone prepare. Ripstop isn't bad. Is it the ripstop you don't like, Bree, or is it the colors in the, of and design of the hat? I think it's uh just really the colors more so than anything. Like yeah. if it was something different, I would probably like it, but I I don't, I don't necessarily like. If that was in traditional colors. Bulls colors, like black without that side patch, right, with just the yeah. red, yeah, that would yeah. look nice. Yeah, that olive is not olive it. and red is weird. Yeah. Same with that yeah. real real tree in red. I I don't know. I do not like that Indian set. I don't mind olive and red. It reminds me of like that dirty martini kind of colorway. Yeah. That we've seen utilized. I think olive goes with red. I mean olive is a neutral color, so olive mm. really technically just about everything goes with it. But some people don't like red with it, some people don't like green with it. I mean it is what it is, right? Yeah. Let's move on to uh six oh six brims. So these dropped in store today, and they will be dropping online tomorrow afternoon. Ooh. Yep. And I posted these on the Views in the Vault account. So one is like, um, I think one is, that's a deep dish pizza on the left. Yep. All the way to the right is an Italian beef. And then the middle mm -hmm. one is just Chicago style. No, it's the Chicago dog. Oh, that's right. Because yep. they don't like it if you just ask for just ketchup. Mm -hmm. Those sons of bitches. It's okay. <laughs> I mean, I, I went out there. I got my hot dog with just ketchup. I, I'd i rather have a regular hot dog and not that Vienna sausage stuff. Mm. Agreed. Yeah, you guys you guys are more conventional hot dog men. Yeah, mm -hmm. I like a nice sobrette, New York style. Yeah, Leon, there you likes go. The, Leon likes those big, thick sausages. He likes hey. the big <laughs> oh, I, I don't mind a quarter pound dog. <laughs> Leon, Leon likes a really like a, like the really big dog. You know he doesn't want. Oh, to he, he just he wants he wants bologna, but just not sliced. Yeah, he, he just doesn't. Wants he, doesn't want, he wants to go right behind a deli counter, and he wants to grab the whole ream of bologna. <laughs> <laughs> so Leon, <laughs> Leon, wow, Leon, are you liking, Leon, we're learning we're learning stuff about you tonight, Leon. Yeah, we'll save a kielbasa talk for later. Um, if I were to pick. Uh, <laughs> Any of these, I think I would get the white card. But uh, where's six? Is six oh six Kentucky? No, six oh six is Chicago. Chicago, okay. North Riverside. Leon, for fuck's sake! It's like there's three Chicago hats on the slide. Right. <laughs> yeah. like, I, don't know, I just googled. Kentucky? I googled. I googled six oh six area code, and it's showing me as Ashland, major city of Kentucky. So it might Maybe. not be the area code. It might be the address or something the, else yeah maybe that's a birth date i don't know False listen, but fair, listen fair enough leon thank you for your thank you for googling but which <laughs> hat here is your favorite uh the white Sox, i guess it's different all right well milo how about you because i know you don't like the cascading logo so i guess the c's off the table i don't I... you don't like these none of these are doing anything special for me yeah Nothing tickles my pickle here. <laughs> whoa, whoa, whoa. Yeah, kibosses <laughs> and bolognese and Nothing. four pound dogs and now pickles, huh? We need that. We need to have a new comment for the bottom now. It says nothing nothing here is tickling tickling my pickle. Yeah. Which of these yeah. tickles your pickle? <laughs> so style, are you afraid to put comments up? I want to see some action today, style. All right, all right, Seriously, you. style. Yeah, stop being a fucking slacker, man, because you don't want to change the screen if, the screen setup. Look at this. Look I, what we did, guys. Look at this. If, nice. if Jose yeah. was here, we would have already seen a thousand comments. <laughs> so there's been a bunch of comments from our faithful viewers that were worthy of being put up there, and you, Style, mm -hmm. are just lazy. Lazy. Listen, do you need Leon to go there and tickle that pickle? Hey. <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm good. You know, my uh, my pickle is pretty comfortable where it is right now. Oh, <laughs> pause. Jesus, oh, too much. Right. You got a lady on this for the night, Style. Oh, what the hell? Oh, Jesus. Style, I want to make sure. Listen, for the rest of this show, your responsibility is to be on top of your game. You understand? If I say pull, pull. If I say, like, let's get let's get comments up to comments up there. All right? All right. Earn your, free, a... earn your free paycheck. Let's move on to 95 North. <laughs> Somebody, Ray, Bree's dog is fucking pissed. Yeah, he was not. He, he wasn't happy with that. He wasn't happy with those comments. Style was making. Listen, I don't know, man. I 
it's interesting that they got that side patch on that Guardians hat. Yeah. Did you guys? <laughs> I can't breathe. She's like, shh. <laughs> that's like the 1909 one, right? Like the super old. Dude, that's like a, 19, that's a 1920. Hat. God damn it, Leon. Time to up the prescription on those spectacles. No, they, you know what they say? Masturbation does hurt your eyesight. <laughs> 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 oh, okay they do say that that's like that's what they tell kids to scare them off from doing it mm-hmm. but uh, all right so we've got these three hats from uh from uh, 95 north you guys liking these i'll start with you milo what are you thinking what's up with this uh this patch this side patch that looks like the hardy's logo i've never seen that before <laughs> <laughs> can, or can call junior for you guys on the west coast there's a lot of things I could be saying right now. But the I Guardians, like, what's yeah, that? The Guardians is okay. Go with the Guardians. But yeah, 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 these, yeah. I, I, I'm going to have to stress that word again, underwhelming. Underwhelming. All right, man. You're underwhelmed today. All right. <laughs> He's not yeah, but an Indian's patch on a Guardian's hat is okay because it is, you know. But I, but I don't understand how they got that one approved. Is that a, that's a World Series patch, right? Mm-hmm. Yes. It's crazy how that slipped through, huh? Yeah. Yeah, loser patch too, right? Because they definitely yeah. weren't using that logo in 1920. No, no. Mm-mm. There's a car alarm going off here. Sorry, guys. <laughs> this is like this has been, had a lot of distractions so far. <laughs> let's, sure. let's move on to can we, just, can, we should just kill this stream and start over. <laughs> <laughs> Anthem's had a slew of hats coming through lately, so they had this uh, California Angels, that Birmingham Barons, the Bisons, Astros. That's the retro double return of the retro double Seattle Mariners with block S, and we got that uh, that incognito. I know Toronto Styles' Blue eyes Day. went right towards that eggplant. Oh yeah, of course it did. <laughs> yeah, that's an interesting. The only hat I'm really not liking here, like not liking, is the Astros one. Okay. <laughs> and uh, Andrew Branch's pickle remains unmoved. See what you've done, Milo? You've turned this into a big show now. Damn. Slowly right. started going downhill. <laughs> All right, Bree. What, what are your Not top slowly. three, Bree? Um, I really like that bison's hat. I think mm-hmm. the bison swinging the bat is like really cute. And then as far as the other ones, I like the Birmingham Barons and I like the block ass, the Seattle Mariners. Mm, okay. All right, what are the bottom three here, Jason? Me, uh, I I don't need anything um, hooked to an eggplant emoji, so the Astros <laughs> is out. Um, you know me, I'm always going to say the Anaheim uh, Disney sellout logo is always out, and then uh, I do not like this version of the Block S. What? Nope. The I don't. Out of here. I don't. The rest of the stuff is great, but. I don't know. I maybe it's just the, the, those two colors together. I, I'm not sure. I just don't. All right. I'm not feeling it. All right. Fair enough. Fair enough. Milo, what's your favorite hat in the slide? I'm gonna have to go Barons on this one because you can't go wrong with black and red and just that script. I don't know. I'm a sucker for that script. Yeah, that's a clean ass hat. Mm-hmm. All right, let's move on. Nice job, Anthem Shop. Let's move on to Burdines out in Chicago. And photo, I'm a block S uh, sommelier, so I only I only prefer the really good ones now. I'm kind of a snob about it now. Oof. All right, this uh, I, you know, listen, I really love these hats, but I think like some of the crazy colors are starting to go by the wayside, right? So some of them, but um, listen, that these these hats are pretty darn good. I'd love to hear mm-hmm. your thoughts on these. Let me start with you, uh, Leon W. Chen. What do you think about these hats? Uh, to me. The clear winner is the one furthest to the left, um, and then the the Astros, uh, the first Astros is is the second winner. I think uh, those are the two they ended up doing a pre order for. So that's probably the ones that garnered the most demand. So you know, shout out to, J- to Jerry for doing that. I wore that Chicago uh, that Chicago hat today. Yeah, um, that thing's a head turner, man. Yeah, that, that thing's a head turner. That's a good ass hat, man. Yeah, and uh, Blank and Brims, I do agree. This is the best slide so far tonight. These are nice, clean hats. The Mariners and the other Astros are good, too. They're all solid hats. Um, Milo, which one's your least favorite? 
Damn, they're all so good. I, mm, I'm going to have to go with the Chrome and Brown Astros. Yeah. And mm. I still like that one a lot. Yeah, I like it too. I, and someone's saying they Photoshopped the button out. When you turn the exposure up on this, it gets... It's white, white on white. Here. I mean, it's... Yeah, what are you going to do? Has he said, uh, best slide, wait till we get to Capland. As style, do your job and block Hezzy for five minutes. <laughs> <laughs> I love Hezzy. I actually like Hezzy, man. You know what? He's a nice guy. When I went up, to, when I met him out in LA, in per- he's a nice guy, man. You know, when you just come up, to the, you're like, this person's really nice. Like, he's that guy. He was very nice. That photo kid, though, the little one, oh. the Hobbit. You just nah, want to drop kick him, don't you? Yeah, listen, I, it, would be, it would be very easy. You don't have to really put an effort in the drop right. at, that, at that height, but yes. Yeah. Um, all right, nice job, uh, Burgines. These are fantastic. Let's move on to Cap USA Harlem. Mm, holy shit. Whoa. Uh. <laughs> hey, Milo, what's yep. the word of the night? Underwhelming. Yep. I thought he was going to say pickle. Well, I, I, yeah, I, as soon as I asked the question, I realized I, I may not get the answer I was looking for. But you know what? Honestly, though, like I, these are just overexposed too. like the pictures are always overexposed. So they, mm-hmm. that's like an olive hat, right? That's olive with pink. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yes. And it looks more like a pickle color. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> the inside of a pickle. What's your favorite hat here, Bree? If I had to pick one, it would probably be the Seattle Mariners in the bottom left. I think just because it's like different. I like the side patch. Yeah. For the All Star game. I don't like Mr. Met like that. Yeah. Mr. Met looks like a pervert, doesn't he? A little. Yeah. (laughs) <laughs> Along with his cousin, Red Legs. He's like, come on, kids, follow me to my van. Uh-huh. All right, let's move on to Capanova. I got to tell you guys, I really loved my time in Capanova, man. What a great place, man. Now, this was their uh, Clone Wars-inspired pack. Mm-hmm. Um, really, really great stuff in this pack. Um, we've done a preview on them, so I'd love to give the floor to both Milo and Bree. What are your, what are your keep two, drop twos in these pack in this pack? <laughs> you can go for it, Milo. I'll keep. I, I always like. Uh, I could always appreciate a good navy hat. Keep the Diamondbacks, and I keep Dove Jason, but red legs. Yeah, <laughs> good hat, man. It's a good hat. And drop two. I'm not like a big corduroy guy. You could get the Montreal out of here, and you know I'm a Yankee fan, so sorry, but. That Boston got to go. What the fuck? Oh, that Boston dude, that that Boston's the hat. best hat on the screen, man. Can't do it. It doesn't matter. I see, I see a lot of Boston hats I like. I just can't do it. <sighs> huh. All right. Well, I, I said um, I'm not Milo, Milo, I want to say, Milo, I want to <laughs> say fuck you respectfully. And I move on to Bree. <laughs> yeah. I think I want to keep um, that Braves. I like the Brown. Um, and then I'll keep the Boston. Thank you, Bree. Um, sorry, Hezzy. I'm gonna drop that Padres. Uh, a lot <laughs> going on there, and mm-hmm. I'll probably drop the. Let's see, I'll drop Red Legs as well. That Rangers hat, you guys didn't pick it, but that thing was good too. Mm-hmm. Yeah, it, that, I would have chose that one. That one was good. I like um, how they colored the logo there on the front. Shout Hezzy, out to Capanova. Oh yeah, no. Listen, I had such a great time out there, man. It was it was such a good vibe out there. The store is beautiful. The team there is great too. Like everyone from Keontra all the way down to everybody that worked in that store, I thought was just amazing. I thought they were just great, man. And you should see them. You know when someone's really good at what they do and they really want to help customers and stuff. You felt so good being in that store. It was just an amazing experience, man. I can't recommend it enough if you're in the LA area to go hit up that store. And I'm not paid to say that, man. I, I'm just telling you, that store had a great vibe to it. I just really, really enjoyed my time there. Um, 
So that's slide one of Capanova. Let's see what else they dropped. All right. So you had uh, you had the pack to the left, um, and now listen, uh, fantastic, fantastic pack of caps. Then you had two caps to the right. That was the Kofax, the Kofax coffee, and the uh, Pink's hot dog. Um, just really, really nice stuff. So, uh, listen, man, it was an event out there. That's for damn sure. And it was fun. So thank you, Capanova, for being fantastic hosts. And for all of you out there, when you get a chance, make sure you support Capanova because what a great business. As we move on to Capland, and let's take a three-second timeout so Hezzy can go grab his tube sock. <laughs> All right, guys, let's play the game. Guess where this is stolen from. So, Jason Mead, do you find any here? I really don't care. These are – if you're going to steal these, like, more power to you. Like, if you're going to steal hats, at least steal good ones. Mm. I don't even care for any of these. I, the upper left one I don't mind at all. Bottom right is like a City Connect hook almost, like what, what they wear. So the City Connect colors in a regular. Yeah. yeah. It's not bad. <laughs> I love this. <laughs> Where did Cat Plant steal a cat from? Let us know. <laughs> this just yeah. has to stay as one of the permanent banners that we utilize because it comes up every time. It is. Yeah. All right. Like, I mean, there's nothing less sexy than, like, five San Diego Padres hats, right? The only thing that yeah. would be less sexy than this would be, like, five Chicago Cubs C's. <laughs> oh. Right? Absolutely. Right. Yeah, let's move on from these. All right, Capsule hats. They had some pretty good stuff here. A dinner plate mess is pretty overwhelming, though. It's a lot of oh, no. It's an awfully big uh, fucking logo there. It just sucks there's nothing in between, right? Because the other one is super small, and then that one is like a chest yeah. plate. It's like a sauce. So, go big or go home, right, Leon? Jeez. So what, do you guys th so what are you guys thinking here? So let, let's play keep three, drop three with Leon. Leon hasn't gotten to play much tonight. All right. I will keep the Chicago Cubs 1990, the Atlanta Braves with a 30th patch. And just to be different, I will keep the uh, New York Yankee guitar pick. Dropping the Arizona script, the, the uh, Mets that dinner plate. Really? And I'll drop the Angels, uh, Black Angels. Dropping the Arizona? Arizona script, yeah. Is it like olive and... No, it's stone and black. No, he's talking about the... The, the, the logo, the logo. Is it like an olive color with peach? I don't know. It's weird to me. It's gold and orange. Even worse. Even worse. <laughs> <laughs> he said double even down, worse. Double down on being wrong, okay? <laughs> Oh man, Milo, you like anything here? <laughs> nah, not at I'm all. I'm not a Yankees fan, but that bottom Yankees hat is kind of. I nice. hate that gold outline. Really? I hate that gold outline. I was trying to like it. Uh, Style just put a new poll up asking a question that's already six months uh, too late, but has the Arizona script lost the hype? Six months? It hasn't even yeah. been hyped for six months, has it? It was hyped for like two weeks, and then it was dead. <laughs> All right, well, let's move on to Clark Street Sports. Big week over at Clark Street Sports. <laughs> um, they dropped this hat, which... Was this Capcom official or something like that? This was their Capcom exclusive... Unexclusive. That they that yeah. they dropped to make it unexclusive. Hmm. Wow. They should have kept it exclusive. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Bree, oh, fight kind of words. Bree, so Bree, tell us tell us what you think about this hat. Oh 
uh, as Milo said, is to me it's very underwhelming. Um, I feel like when it comes to like Chrome domes these days, like there's constant Chrome domes coming out, and so like if I had to pick one, it wouldn't be this. Um, and then like the olive, I think that's in the side patch and behind the actual cub in the circle. To me, it throws it off. Maybe if it had been a different color, um, it would have worked better. Would have worked better with the um, almost infrared in that light blue. Yeah, their pictures are like they're up there with like Pro Image with some of the worst pictures. <clears throat> Things all half photoshopped and shit. Like it, it's like a mess. Yeah, it's like flying. In the air, too. Does anyone like this hat? Not this one. No. All right, let's move on to clink room. Leon, have you done your clink room homework? Of course. Oh. Um, these go up for pre order until April 23rd with estimated uh, time of delivery for September uh, 2023. Uh, we will start off with To the Moon, uh, Faded Flashy, and uh, Seamus. Um, did a a 420 uh, type design. Um, that one's pretty cool. Party Animal by uh, Milos um, and our good friend Donovan. Uh, Party Animal. That one's interesting. It's like a bear partying. Uh, Never Give Up. Yeah, um, that is that. a shoe bill. Um, a prehistoric bird that exists today. This is pretty pretty cool uh, animal. There, he's getting choked out by by a frog. I I want to I want to know who's going to win that battle. Yeah, <laughs> I think the shoe bill is going to win in the end. I think, but we'll see. Well, if the frog, I mean, he's not going to be able to swallow the frog if the frog keeps a hold of that <laughs> throat like that. Like yeah, he's giving the. It depends. Are there, any, are there any? Are there any toxins or poisons in the saliva of the shoe bill? No, but there might be in the frog, depending on the frog, right? Right. Like so, this this is a very suspenseful you know, hat. I need to know. I, you don't. You don't know if the shoe bill doesn't have poisons in it, poison in his mouth. And can can someone please get the do not forget to follow at Clark Street Sports off of the uh, clink room slide? <laughs> Jesus bad, Christ, style. <laughs> God, it's hard to it's hard to hire good free help these days. <laughs> you gotta raise the style. Style. I'm, tr it's it's style. I'm trying to like I'm trying to like navigate this show right now. I have to correct your fucking homework too. Like can I was you just so excited. Part of the show. I was so excited to highlight that comment that I forgot to switch the banner. God damn it. I've been watching, man. I've been watching. All right. So, Jason, I mean, Leon, before you were so rudely interrupted by uh, the <laughs> incompetence of style, um, oh could you God. continue, please? Uh, yeah, Gone Fishing. So that's a kingfisher with an alligator. Flanagan um, was raised in uh, Florida or grew up in Florida. But now he hails from Ohio, uh, Jason's favorite place. Um, Wind Studio has the Sky Kings uh, to focus on. Uh, birds as the kings of the sky, so to speak. And Raphael has hidden danger. Once that glows in the dark, you will see a scorpion. Oh. Mm. Raphael, remember him? Mm -hmm. What was that? Uh, one? Fighting dirty. Was that? Fighting dirty. Fighting dirty. <laughs> the worst designed <laughs> logo I've ever seen way. in my fucking life. He's coming a long way. Do you remember it was like a slingshot or something? What was it again? Yeah, we, we thought it was a uh, snowman with the with a carrot, but it was like a stick <laughs> with stuff. I don't know, like rock with stick. A, in it. Never, it was, no, it was a snowball with a, a stick and a rock in it. Oh, what? Something. Okay, something yeah, like yeah, yeah. Leon, uh, they really like when you uh, narrate uh, the clink room. <laughs> We used to lose viewers. Now we gain them when you start to start that uh, that segment. I'm proud of that. Pretty interesting, right? Mm -hmm. Yes, and this is a good time to say: make sure you like, please. And if you're not subscribed, please subscribe. So right now we have 64 likes. We've had as many as 160 people in here. Let's hit that like button, everybody, as we continue along here. And if you're not subscribed, I'm not sure why that would be. Why are you here if you're not subscribed? Subscribe to the channel. Subscribe. So with that, let's move on to Cool Jays. Jeez, our screen's having like a seizure or something. Yeah, now it's making me fucking dizzy. Now this guy's like yeah, all well, over the place. What the hell's going right. on here? So I heard Cool Jays' website was fantastic um, when they uh, dropped. Those, uh, <laughs> I don't even. Six. I still don't know if it's still if it's working yet. 
Oh wow! Shut it down. <laughs> no, like yeah. you, you, you could get on the site, but you couldn't get to any of the hats. So, like, yeah, it was a mess. Hopefully, they figured it out. These are great. These are great hats, man. Do you like any of yeah. these, uh, Milo? Yeah. Well, this one's the Snoop Dogg hook, right? The uh, Los Angeles. Yeah. 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 And then, and then the the Yankees was uh, DMX. No, cent. no, that was uh, okay. that was fifty cent. Yeah, get rich or die crying. Yeah, those are my two favorite right there for sure. You don't Great. like the pit bull? No, no, I'm good on the pit bull. <laughs> you think I'm profiling you right now? <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> <laughs> Is that what you're thinking? Yeah. I, some people actually like the pit bull hat though. That's my least favorite, right? Was that the one I picked last? I believe so. Yeah. And All right. So Milo's favorites nasty. are dog. Milo's favorites are doggy style, and get rich or die trying. How about you, Rachel? I mean, Bree. <laughs> I like the, Rachel. Yeah. No. Yeah. That's my middle name uh, for the Instagram tag. But I like um. I like the future hood at Atlanta. And I then, like that one too. Um. I mean, that Kanye hook, I know his hooks are sort of kind of played out, but I like that take on the Cubs hat for sure. Yeah, that one looks good, right? Yeah, that one looks – I'm looking on their website. That one looks like it's sold out, the Kanye. But the yeah, the Cubs one – so apparently some people are able to get through. The Cubs sold out like almost right away. Listen, we dropped our hats on Cool Jays. The, the site crashed too, remember? Yeah, it crashes every drop they have. I gotta talk to Felix. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yeah, no, Melvin. I know. I chose that. That Atlanta one is my that that thing is so nice, man. I like I like that one a lot. I think what was my second? My second was the Los Angeles, and third was Kanye. I think so. Yeah. Then you had Houston. That that, what'd you say, Leon? You had a Houston as second last, if I remember correctly. Yeah, that that Yankees one is good, man. Mm-hmm. Good hat. Metallics is uh, nice. Yeah, yeah, good drop, man. All right, so let's move on to Crown Legends, guys. All right, so Crown Legends um, had the Mud Pack 2.0 drop. Those six hats dropped, and boy, is that Seattle Mariners compass pretty large. <laughs> Large and in charge, as they like to say. Um, but this is your last chance, guys. So we want to give everyone an opportunity here. We'll, we'll put the show on pause if necessary. But those four hats on the bottom are on pre-order right now. So um, you've got that uh, Stone Cold Steve Austin uh, inspired real tree camo. And then you've got Utopia 1.0 and 2.0. And you got the Boston gas all the way to the right. So... Listen, if you haven't had a chance to do it, they are going to be closing this pre-order very shortly. So if you're watching right now, you want to go and get that pre-order, I'd go do it now before they close that thing down. Listen, everyone says, I can't hit, I can't hit, I can't hit. Well, now's your chance to hit, right? Mm-hmm. So go head over to Crown Legends right now and get this pre-order uh, secured for yourself if you haven't already. And anyone who's pre-ordered already, why don't you write in the comments what you did pre-order and kind of share it with the rest of the rest of the class. But I'll leave it up to you guys. Uh, I'll start with you, uh, Bree. Which of those four pre-orders do you like the best? Um, I like, what is it, the gas station one that's on the far okay. right. I like, yep. uh, I know cascading logos with me, it's sort of kind of hit or miss, but I like to play on that one. I've liked that one since I dropped it originally. All right. How about you, Leon? What's your favorite? Uh, the Stone Cold. Mm. All right, style. I haven't asked you much tonight. What do you What do you like the best? Um, I like the um, probably the Utopia 2.0. It's like a it's like a good Bruins hook too, right? Mm-hmm. Yeah, for sure. Standalone Entertainment says Crown Legends pass. Huh. Mm. Why. Tell us where they touched you. Stone alone entertainment. Oh my gosh. <laughs> yeah. I think he'll stand alone without opinion. Yeah. <laughs> that's the, that's like the best thing you've ever said on this show, Style. 
Thanks. I think yes. I think comment of the night goes to Chris Brooks. Uh, I got the poopy pirates. <laughs> <laughs> okay. And you know what? Again, style misses yeah. miss an opportunity to put up a fantastic comic. He's too busy. Tickle to tickle. Let's move on to Crown Minded, everybody. You're nice. Yeah, they restock some good hats. I like that Phillies. I'm a sucker yeah. for that logo. I do too. I like that one too, man. It's got this old feel to it, right? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I like the Rangers. Yeah, that's like a cowboy's, cowboy's hook. Cowboy. Yeah, I like that. Like a hat. Yeah, the other two are very like much pedestrian, right? But those two, yeah, that fighting Phils and that and that and that Rangers are nice. Yeah, another nice job from another nice drop. Let's move on to Dairy Club, everybody. I think they had a little shock drop because Jason forced it. <laughs> what is not my problem? All right. Copper drop this drop. I'll start with you, Leon, and we'll go down the row. Uh, I would drop it. All right. It's like, like it's hot? Yeah, this is. I never really like the pink. I never really like the pink lemonades when they originally came out, and these are like a like a crazier version of them. Leon, have you ever dropped it like it's hot? I'm not. (laughs) (laughs) Really cold over here. So you've never dropped it like it's hot, Leon? Guess not. Okay, Milo, you copping or dropping this drop? Dropping all of those. All right. Wait a second. Style, style, you just asked the question on screen instead of actually doing a poll. What the hell? I thought that's what the banners were for. Hold on. God damn it. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So Jason, you copper drop this. Oh, uh, I actually I actually like uh like this colorway. I think it's a better version of the pink lemonade. Yeah. How Especially the Oreo Orioles and the Yankees. I have a feeling Bree likes this drop. Do you like this drop, Bree? So that's what I exactly I was gonna say, Jason. Like if I I wouldn't drop it, but if I were gonna cop any of them, it would be the Orioles or the Yankees would be the two mm-hmm. that I would buy. Sure. <laughs> <laughs> Style for once you got it right. <laughs> All right, so let's move on to ECAP City, guys. All right. Oh, look at look, look at Milo is like kind of rubbing his hands together. He's excited about this slide. Milo he spent sixty seven dollars on that Los Twins hat, man. It's, you like that metallic oh. brim? Yeah, I like that metallic brim, and I usually don't like stuff like that, but I like that it's metallic, but also like a sneaky two tone. You know what I mean? Yeah, no, no, I like, I, like, I like that side pass, the bomba squad. I liked it. Jason Mead is not a fan of that metal, that metallic visor, but I did like it. Uh, yeah, that's know. the worst hat on the screen. Oh, the fuck out here is not. Yeah, it is. Stomper's worse. Well, no, okay, okay, okay Stomper. Man, okay. That Stomper's and that Mets, too. I like the yeah. Mets. I like the Mets, yeah. yeah. That turquoise against that green UV, I don't know. Ooh, all right. You, you nah, made a valid point, my friend. Leon, mm-hmm. which of these hats is your favorite? Maybe the Astros. I mean, they're still scared of using black. There's no black on any of these hats, um, unless it's metallic. But uh, if I were to pick one, it's probably between the Astros or the Mets, or is that the Giants? The New York, the New York one. Yeah, Leon, if you're gonna if you were gonna evaluate. These hats, right, and say, all right, this hat best represents Styles performance tonight so far. <laughs> Which would it be? The Dodgers. Explain. Is it hit or miss. <laughs> <laughs> I demand kind of a rate. Flat. Kind of flat. <laughs> uh, we'll give you we'll give you a, a th- 50% raise, Style. Thank you. Thank you. Yep. All right, Style, you're now making uh, $0 an hour. Okay. Okay. 
was trying to figure out what 50% of zero was. And yeah, it's still nothing, isn't it? That's well, you good are for a, a teacher. You are a fucking teacher. So you <laughs> no. you. I, I teach I teach English. We don't know math. We don't do numbers. Oh, okay. All right. So you're like you so like English teachers are like the dumb ones. <laughs> yeah. If you can't what? teach any, if you can't teach anything else, you teach English. That's P E. Oh shit. Oh man, you're just dogging all the PE teachers. <laughs> Damn. Damn. Uh, all right, let's move on to eight one. Oh, so these hats are just the Greek, I think they call this. The what? The Greek. Why? Because it's uh it's like the flag. Kind of no, it's like, hooked uh, to like a Greek restaurant in Houston. They better be careful like, of that shit, man. They, they already got themselves in hot water. Well, they, that's where they took the pictures at too. Yeah. Yeah. These what? fuckers, they don't. They're they're like they are like these guys are straight up hat gangsters. They're like, oh, you want to get us in trouble for this? Yeah, you know what? We're not going to a donut shop. We're going to go to the Greek restaurant next. <laughs> mm-hmm. Yeah, I mean they didn't do a pop up there, so they just did a photo shoot there. Yeah. So, I guess they followed the, the outlined rules, I guess. God, these guys are living dangerously, right? Yeah, they're, they're tippy-toeing on the line. Do you like this hat? Oh, again, with the chrome domes. I mean, it's nice. Don't necessarily got to have it. Milo, does this excite you at all? No, I, I like the Carolina blue outline on it. I think it looks clean. Yeah, it's just it's a clean hat, right? All right, well, let's move on. To energy. What the fuck are these? Uh, so these are hooked to kid shows. What in God's fucking name is that thing on the right? That is that. I I, I don't know. It's some bear. If one of us didn't pick kid. that as a weeper this week, I'm gonna fucking uh, I'm gonna go off. Well, you better change your weeper then. I didn't pick it. I didn't pick. I didn't even see that one until now. I like. Is the there one uglier on the hat that we've seen tonight? <laughs> what? There's no uglier hat that we've seen that we've seen tonight than that. Yeah. Not yet. I mean, we're on E, but yeah, not yet. <laughs> <laughs> Usually it gets nah, rough man. later. Dude, that is the worst looking hat I, I I've seen in a long time. Yeah, they didn't. That is logo is not great. Is that chrome or like a blush? I think it's chrome. I think it's just a bad picture. Yeah. Is the chrome what's bothering you? No, it's that logo. Here, no, no, no. It's the blue on blue on blue with a thing of brown in the middle. <laughs> so it's like basically like a turd floating in a toilet. <laughs> Dang. My son and I watched like Cocaine Bear the other day. Yeah. So I see you commented about what a fucking crazy movie, man, that Cocaine Bear. I don't know what got me to watch that, but that shit was insane. <laughs> This hat is disgusting, though. I can't unsee the turd in the toilet bowl. No. <laughs> Dang. Like the aerial view of it. Yeah, it's it's like somebody just cleaned the toilet, so there's that blue cleaner left in there, and then splash down. Got it. You gotta be pretty accurate to make that design, though. It's like two-part. Mm-hmm. That's disgusting. <laughs> what about, does anyone like the Braves hat? Braves like is actually it. okay, yeah. I like that one. I don't the problem with Braves has it sitting next to this other one. <laughs> right. That's the Hey Arnold, I think, right? Yeah. Football hit. Dude, that one on the right is is it's actually making me like nauseous. <laughs> <laughs> wait wait until style moves the screen around a little bit more too. So Oh yeah. He's got me all disoriented. Let's move yeah. on exclusive fitted. <sighs> wow. All right. They hit you with the double hype. Well, they did. I can't say these are ugly, though. Oh, they're fine. It's just it's the same old stuff from them week after week after week. You got to love Jamaica Avenue, Houston, Texas. Mm-hmm. <clears throat> yep. Astros and Realtree. 
One thing Those about Astros and Realtree are nice, man. They are, but that's all we're going to see from them for the next six months. That's what I was going to say. One thing about them, they're consistent of like once the hype gets started. <laughs> oh, yeah. They're going to give you what you want. You know, it's, it's going to be available. Mm-hmm. <sighs> Milo, you like any of these? I mean, it's just I think the fact that like we all know it's a money grab is just kind of like takes away from the hats. Like I feel like if, mm-hmm. if that wasn't the case, we might actually like some of these. You know what I'm saying? I agree. I think you're right. I think if there were like multiple teams on here, right? Yeah. Different teams, like, and it didn't look like such a such a like an egregious money grab as you as you said. It, like we'd be more, they we'd find it more appealing. Mm-hmm. Right. Absolutely. Right, look, look, look at that gray colorway. They did three different Astros logos in that one colorway. <laughs> and then threw in the Arizona script just because they were yep. was hyped for a little bit. Mm-hmm. And then we and then they threw in the Phillies just to throw us all off. Hey, we're we're making some shitty hats too. We're not just money grabbing here. <laughs> yeah. I don't know. The two real trees are the winners for me, though. I like those. Yeah. Leon, yeah. well, what do you like here? Uh, the middle um, Astros is the best hat on the slide, I think. And I'm just not into like the whole like let's take a like a neutral color and throw some. Metallics and pastels are <coughs> boring to me. Yeah. All right. Well, let's move on to fam. Speaking of boring. The prototype is, is nice. Back. Have we seen the yeah. prototype somewhere else? Yeah. Okay. <clears throat> Can't say I'm upset about the theft. <laughs> nope. Should have put an alarm on that car. <laughs> <laughs> Thought the M3 didn't come with one, but apparently not. Well, yeah, that was that was a good one. Yeah. <laughs> the other the other three are like like Jason Mead specials from like three years ago. Those are things Jason Mead would have fucking eaten right up. I do, I do like the Detroit one. The Detroit one's the only good one. Yeah, that one. No, but Jason, this is like a this is like a throwback to you though, right? This is yeah. like the shit you would have gotten excited about three or four years ago. No, he would have been pissed because they ruined a perfectly good front panel hat with side with patches. Patch. Yeah, yeah, with the side. He wouldn't have liked the okay, side. Okay, style. What you, you guys remember like when we when we got on the throw like, some comments up there or something, right? You guys remember when he first like admitted he liked the side patch? Can you guys you guys mm-hmm. we did a whole we did a whole uh, Instagram live on it. Mm-hmm. <laughs> we did a whole live on it. That was funny. Mm-hmm. Yeah, you used to call him the side patch sommelier, you remember? We even had a pin of it and everything. Mm-hmm. Yep, I remember. I remember. Man, those were the times. Those <laughs> were the damn. times. Those were God the damn. days. God damn it, Style. How did you miss this comment? <laughs> like, that's a good one. Chris Brooks, man. Commenter yeah. of, the, of the day. Yeah. 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 Nice job, man. Chris, you, I don't know what got into you today, man, but nice work. Nice work. All right. Let's move on to fan treasures. It's always refreshing to see a fan treasure slide. Bree, what are you thinking about here? What are you liking here? Anything? Uh, I like that Seattle Mariners and the Bisons, and then I had to drop those. What is it? The Italian Ice ones. Mm, I think they restocked those. Um, I'm good on those. Okay, my love. I'm not liking the Chrome hats lately. But see, see, that's the thing. It's just yeah. It's the Chrome. It's like got to stick out to me at this point. Yeah, because it's like I have like over. 10 or 12 of those so it's like it's got to be really different from something that i already have to like grab another one ah fair enough milo what do you like in here i like the mariners i'm a sucker for blue and yellow and uh again the fighting phillies i knew you were going there it's Mm -hmm. easy i like that 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 side patch on that phillies one is good too Yeah, no, I have to agree with you, Chris. Those pictures, like, these stores have to – there's a reason why they, they, they send me hats and ask me to take pictures for people. 
It really mm-hmm. is because it's not not that hard to do, but some folks struggle with it. It's all about the angle, man. You just raise the angle up a little bit, you know. You you stuff the hat with something. Not that hard. I just wish they would get better pictures. Because you're right. Like some people won't buy a hat because of a picture. Oh yeah. Mm-hmm. Right. Yeah. All right. Let's move on to fresh rags. Leon, keep yourself calm here, buddy. <laughs> oh my god. Oh shit. Leon, why don't you narrate these two? What are these two? Uh, the one on the left is a Titanic hook. I yep. believe. Uh, 1919 was when it sank, so they took the 2019 side patch uh, hook to the Hope Diamond. Um, the Titanic was uh, infamously en route to New York when it sank. Um, that's the 2012 side patch, so it sank in 2012. 1912. 1912, sorry. Okay, 2012, yep. yeah. Uh, and to complete this uh, romance pack, as uh, Mike <laughs> called it, uh, Fifty Shades of Grey for the Seattle. <laughs> for, for people that don't know, um, Leon is a Fifty Shades of Grey aficionado. Um, Leon mm-hmm. has read the book. I don't books. read. Never admitted to it. Books. And, uh, and he well, somebody, movie. Well, somebody, he read the book on tape. He listened right. to the book. Yeah, that's right. While 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 dripping hot wax on his chest. <laughs> <laughs> he does These are actually uh, really good hats, though. That that Yankees one man is beautiful. So let me ask you a question, Milo. You're a Yankees fan, right? Unfortunately. Yeah. All right. So do you like that Yankees hat or no? Nah, it's not doing anything special for me. Yeah. You don't like mismatched uh, side patches? No. No, that's fair. That's fair. Some people don't. Um, Bree, do you share uh, Leon's love of Fifty Shades of Grey, specifically the Seattle Mariners hat? <laughs> uh, I don't know if I love it as much as Leon, uh, but – I, I have mm-hmm. read it. It's okay. But the hat is okay. nice. I like the uh, metallic on the um, on the S. So you okay. like the book? I didn't say that. <laughs> <laughs> I, didn't, I didn't say that. So you tolerated the book? Like, well, how, I how did. Would you, you tolerated it. Like you got through. Yeah. So for Leon, it's like a fucking event. Like it's, like, it's like, this is it, man. Like, I've never seen – he loves this fucking book. Not he true. loves this fucking book. You guys weren't on. When we were doing the preview show for this and I told him it was a Fifty Shades of Grey hat, he asked to be tripled up on the hat. <laughs> when the author was doing a book tour in Canada, he told us that he was – he's <laughs> camped out for like three days at his Barnes & Noble just so he could be first in line. Dang. Fucking Leon, Leon takes it so well. Like Le- I've never seen someone <laughs> take it as well. Well, I mean, he's here. got experience from that Fifty Shades of Grey. You know, <laughs> Leon take it. is like Leon is Leon's a good dude, man. Let's move on to future reference. I, I feel like if I fight back, I'm hurting my case. So I'm just <laughs> <laughs> talk myself out of it. We'll let the room. We'll let the room decide. Leon, the room is uh is thinking yeah. that you're a big Fifty Shades of Grey fan. I don't think the room the room knows. Uh, or thinks that I can read, so I'm, I'm going to use that as a, <laughs> as, <laughs> as a thing. Let's move, on to, let's move on to future reference. <laughs> These are uh, rich. It's regular material? Oh, cord- Is that or corduroy? Yeah. Corduroy brim. Yeah. Corduroy that looks brim. like a cotton crown, though. It looks weird, right? Yeah. Look at canvas. Looks what do they call what do they call that UV? That's mango. Nah, it's like uh, rust, maybe. Rust, maybe. Rust I don't think it's quite rust. It's like, it peanut, is. like that peanuts, that peanut color. You're definitely doing something to their photos. I like the color scheme of these, though. Yeah, they're not That's bad. Nice. Actually, if it didn't have a cord brim, I probably would have gotten one. I'm just over mm-hmm. cord right now. Is that that wizard's blue that everyone's using? No, no, no. no. Wizard's this blue is like, like this. The wizard's blue is like this, Leon. Yeah. 
Liam, that's a Liam. You're a little off here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. That's like a dark. That's like a midnight navy almost, right? Yeah, it's almost black. Hmm. Thank you, right, Adrian. Let's move on to Hack Club. Milo, I hope we're not losing you, bud. No, nah, no. Nah, nah. You're still you're still right with us, right? Yes, uh... All right. So Hack Club had what is that? What is that Guardian set? What's that about? Is that like a goblin? No idea. Sort of pops a little bit. Yeah. It's interesting. Thank you, Adrian. Welcome to the live stream. We appreciate having you here. I hope you hit that like button, though. <laughs> oh, man, he said Gatorade. I don't, I don't yeah. see that. Like a Hulk, maybe? I don't know. I mean, it could be a Green Goblin hook, I suppose. Yeah, it looks kind of like that, right? Like an old school yeah. Green Goblin? Yeah. Listen, I finally found a City Connect remix I really don't like. You don't like that, Royals? No. Oh, I like the Royals. I like that one. The side patch is underwhelming, but the front's okay. Is there anything you like here, Milo? I like the Angels hat and the Royals. Hmm. <clears throat> Except for that side patch. I don't know what's going on with that Royal side patch. It's like a fountain. I think it's like yeah. a city mm -hmm. of many fountains or something. It's a bunch of people peeing on a rock. Dang. Oh, there you go. Kansas doesn't have a lot to claim to, so... <laughs> They're, they're sticking to the fountain thing. Well, that's Missouri, oh, like right? Toronto's just a jewel of, yeah. Come on, Leon. There's a thousand fountains in Kansas City. How many fountains does Toronto have? When you're not peeing on the sidewalk, weren't you in trouble for peeing on the sidewalk in Kansas? <laughs> oh, he's right. I remember this. Yeah, Where? yeah. That was that was in Kansas. This is in Missouri. <laughs> oh, Big okay. difference. <laughs> In Missouri, you're allowed to pee Leon, on the <laughs> Leon stored away like little little bits of yeah, information yeah. to use later. Now, <laughs> yeah, Lawrence, Kansas. That's where uh, they, uh, that was wanted posters deal, up on the on the walls. But there. that's when Jason was more guarded and sensitive. You remember? Yeah, and it came fuck, out. And then fuck it... Lawrence. <laughs> <laughs> oh shit! All right, let's move on to the second slide of Hack Club. Get your cord, Phil. Hey, you listen, Hack Club was the last one to draw to jump onto the cord train, too. Yeah, because I think these ones had like the the tag inside, so they probably had to make them a long time ago, like two years <clears throat> ago, whatever. The only ones that I think Jason and I agreed on this, right, Jason? That we only liked really the the reddish ones. Mm. I don't remember. That was two days ago. <laughs> you like the chrome ones too a little bit, I think. I, th I think I did, yeah. I don't think any of these are well executed, though. <sighs> no. Would you prefer yeah. these ones or the teddy bears? The teddy no, bears? The, the ones with the, the, these ones. patch on it? For sure. Which ones do you prefer, Jason? <clears throat> these ones over yeah. the teddy bears. I don't need that weird button on the front and the patch on the back. I think I go teddy bear personally. Oh my yeah. god, Leon, <laughs> Leon, you're just off tonight. Did you did you not eat before I the just, show? No, no, I definitely ate. Uh, I don't. Miss <laughs> um, uh, <laughs> I just listen. <laughs> I want to make something clear. I think we're all. I think we're all clear on this. Leon doesn't miss many meals. I want to be clear on this. Yeah. yeah. So, um, I just to make sure because you're you're definitely off tonight. No, I just I just feel like. Like remixes of their current colorways in chord wasn't something that really. I don't know. I don't like you can do it with like black domes, I guess. Like that's kind of cool, but like with these is like no one was calling for these. I feel like. Milo, are you are you you're, you don't like cord, right? Are there any no. of these that you would you would wear? No, and especially it's getting warmer, so you can't wear cord in you know spring. Um, uh, if I had to pick one, I'd probably go. I don't know, nah. These are all poop. <laughs> okay. If they if they weren't if they weren't cord, would these be better? It'd be a little bit more tolerable. <laughs> he doesn't like these. No. Like I feel like the top is kind of useful because if that was in poly, you wouldn't get it. But because it's in cord, you might get a chrome hat. I don't know. 
that didn't make any sense to me. So if, if the top hat was in, in, in poly, you might not get it if it's like an off-white color. But because it's in cord, you might be more white. I'm still not going to get it. Okay. Yeah, but I see what you're saying, Leon. You're saying someone might do that, right? P potential. Like if you were feeling the need to get an all-chrome hat. It's different enough, at least. But like, right. I don't know who's saying, like, oh, I wish they made a pink martini in cord. cord. And it's like, finally, the pink martini is available in corduroy. You know, like, I don't but know. even the color on the red ones, right? Like, that they use on the front logos, like, it doesn't, it's weird, right? I yeah. feel like the beige or whatever is weird on the red yeah, ones. Yeah, weird, man. Yeah. Those look like Christmas ornaments down there. Yeah. That's exactly like the, Merlot, the Merlots were solid when they came out, but like, as a chord version, it's the gr it's the green on these that I don't I don't like. Yeah. Anyway. anyway, let's go to hat dreams. These are nice hats. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. I like these. I like them. They're making that W tolerable, right? tolerable, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah, you got to dress it up in metallics. Like the two tone, the best. It's like everybody looks good on prom night, right? <laughs> All right, nice uh, showing from Hat Dreams. They've been doing great stuff lately, man. Oh yeah, mm -hmm. they've been on fire. Let's move on to Hat Heaven. Solid. Mm -hmm. I don't know if I want that cock hat. <laughs> <laughs> what did you say? Leon? You said you said I don't know if I want that cock hat, and I said it makes you look like a dickhead. <laughs> <laughs> You're pretty proud of yourself, huh, motherfucker? I'm saying, I don't know how many people like cocks on the head. That's all. <laughs> no, I'm gonna leave that one alone. Like that is one hat I do I do not need. Hmm. Just a good cock fighting hat, I guess. I don't know. <laughs> that fighting fills is good though. Yeah. Vero Beach are solid. Indians are solid. So Milo, do you like um Milo, do you like um that, that fighting fills? You like plain Janes? Yeah, I like plain Janes. Uh what? I actually like every hat here except for the LA, the Rays. And the dickhead hat. <laughs> uh, some of these aren't plain Janes, but he doesn't do pictures where he shows the logo and the side patch at the same time. And I'm not going to do extra work for this this slide. So Fair this enough. is what we get. Oh, there's definitely no side patch on the on the cock hat. I don't know. Vero Beach is a nice hat too, though. I like nice that Vero Beach. Yeah. That's a nice hat. All right, guys, let's move on to hat stop. No, oh, I see what we have going on here. Now we don't just take hats. We're gonna take some and just flip some colors. Yep. It works. Man, those world baseball classic hats been going have been going crazy. Is this another money grab? I don't know. I was in a, I was in a locker room with Downey, and the Mexico, like, world, like world baseball classic hat, was going fucking bananas. They had like just, just I'm talking while I was in there, they the people were just buying them up, man, buying them up, buying them up, yeah. buying them up. It, it was they, insane. Hat stuff has done like five or six colorways of that Mexico hat. Every oh, single time, it's gone in thirty seconds. Yeah. Well, Mexico also was doing good in the World Baseball Classic. Yeah, they definitely. I mean, this one, this one dropped yesterday, and it was gone, like that. Good for them. Mm -hmm. I'm telling you, when I was in the locker room down, I never seen anything like it. It was crazy. They were just, they had it in the corner there where they have, they have like this little corner where there's like uh, Mexican baseball league hats, right? Mm -hmm. And then they had like all these World Baseball dude. There were people just going, uh, just buying them. Like I'm. I'm talking. This isn't exaggerated. They're just buying them. Like every second, another one was selling. Whoever mm -hmm. whoever does that baby blue and pink first, 
is it, it's gonna go crazy because they debuted those uh, alternate jerseys and you can't find that hat anywhere. I don't think they, ever... they wear the where are the jerseys? They wore them. Yeah, they wore them. It's okay. like a Miami Vice colorway, but no one has the hat. So whoever whatever store does that first, it's gonna go crazy. Hmm. What do you like in here, uh, Milo? You were talking about money grab here a little bit. So what, yeah, there's what, a lot of squip going on here. You know what I'm saying? Like that's like I, I don't know. It's kind of I don't know if it's money grab. It's scripts are in. That's for sure. Yeah. Um. I like the block S. I like that yellow against that green. That Mets hat I just bought my wife today, but that was it was from Four U uh, Four U Caps, and it was the same thing, uh, different side patch I think, but same exact colorways. That one's fire. I like the Baltimore, Montreal. There's some heat here. Yeah, there is. I kind of like that. That Baltimore is my favorite. Yeah, yeah, I, I would say so too. Free, what's your favorite? Um. Like the Seattle. Was that King Dome one? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Damn it, Bree. <laughs> Bree, it looks like a punch bowl on the side of the hat. <laughs> it, I know, but I like yeah. the teal and the navy. That's navy, yeah. right? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. yeah. yeah. Script wise, that's probably one of the nicer scripts, right? That's a nice script. But they There's ruined it. That side that right, yeah. I would have preferred if they put that, what, the 2023 All Star game? That'd be good. They may no, not be able to use it with that script. Oh, okay. Yeah. They should be able to. Maybe I don't know. They got good patches, though, right? 40, 35. They have some great patches. And then yeah. every, this this place continues to use that fucking keen gun one. It's weird. I don't know. Well, let's move on to lids. Like the, these are just like the uh the hat club drop, right? Mm-hmm. Yeah, but the mm-hmm. eyelets are, are tonal here. And these have a gray under instead of green. Okay. These are the what happens in Vegas stays in Vegas. I saw them use that punchline. Vegas average. Knights or something like that. Yeah. I don't know. They're clean. Uh, <clears throat> no, I like the colorway. Yeah. Mm-hmm. I like the Toronto. I like the KC. Cubs. There's a lot of good ones here. Mm-hmm. They are. I do like these. Team colors on black usually is easy cheat code, right? It is a cheat code for sure. Yeah. Mm-hmm. There's some nice ones here. Even the San Francisco is nice. Mm-hmm. There's not many I wouldn't get. Is there anything here that's standing out to you, uh, Milo? Uh, I'm a sucker for the Montreal logo. Yeah. No matter what. Um, it's funny. I bought that one in the Hat Club version, the Montreal one. Yeah. It had was... a different, a slightly different logo. It's the one that had the Expos written below it, though. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Why am I not even seeing them? Oh, there it is. Okay. No, no. Yep. Got it. What else? Anything else stand out to you, Milo? I like the Brave script. Gotta go a little high beast on that one. Yeah, that's nice too. The problem is that they probably didn't change the navy. So you got navy blue on black, Mm -hmm. which I can't Mm -hmm. I can't do that. Yeah. How about you, Bree? Anything stand out to you? So um I saw some of these hats in the store last weekend. They're yeah, unfortunately Memphis like doesn't get like that cool of teams, but I would really be interested in seeing that Cincinnati in person because that dude looks like a Pringle can. For sure. <laughs> you're right. You know, so it's you're probably going to lead a bunch of people at home to start making Pringles flavors with that logo. <laughs> I mean, once I don't you know. pop, you can't stop, right, Bree? <laughs> Maybe so. These are good though. They, yeah. These are solid, man. This is a good drop. Nothing too adventurous, but it's a good drop. Yeah. Let's move on to Liz Hat Drop. All right. So you you corrected us, Milo. So why don't you pronounce it for us on the air? Santuse. Leon, practice now. Santuse. That was pretty good. Was Was that right? You've taught me a word. You taught Leon a word now. There you go. Bree. Uh, You want me to say say the word? 
Yeah. <laughs> Santuse. There you go. Nice. Style, you're the whitest guy in the panel. You say it. Santuse. <laughs> he said it the whitest. <laughs> <laughs> What do you guys think of these? Honestly, you, are, is anyone here? Uh, is anyone here okay with the uh, that melton? Well, not really melton wool, but that wool-looking crown. Does anyone like it? Mm -mm. So I when I see the Ebbets Fields hats get posted, like the yeah. ones, um, they they always look like they don't really have like much shape. Like they have that older like weird shape to it these look like they're shaped a little bit better but i don't know i i feel like this would be a little hot on my head maybe these are definitely now, structured caps mm -hmm. Th these are like 5950s okay yep i understand why they went with the gray though they, they're doing it to have that old school like feel retro too. feel yeah yeah these can stay back in the 40s I, I'm confused. Do you do you know why like uh, the Memphis uh, Red Sox aren't in this? Like, whenever they do the Negro League stuff, they I know did they Memphis have... Red Sox the first time around. Yeah, because I I have that one, but like ever since they've been doing any of the other Negro League stuff, like I haven't seen any of them. I wonder like what's the reasoning behind leaving them out? I don't know. Probably just cool. based on sales numbers. Yeah, it might not be the most popular. Then that's fair. Well, it's also difficult to pull off, I think, right? Because the Memphis one has Red Sox written in the M. Yeah, it does, yeah. Who knows? That could be part of it, too. But I think that's uh, that's one of my favorite um, Negro League logos. Not yeah. because it's it's just, like, really done well. It's like that, that M with Red Sox kind of embroidered within it. It's really cool. That's one that looks like uh, on, on a Letterman's jacket, right? Yeah, yep. yeah. Yeah. Mm yeah. -hmm. I love that thing. But most of you are, like, the – Popularish teams, right? He would say yeah. maybe not Veracruz so much, but oh, Veracruz is very popular. Okay, right. I think did these have like the chain stitching on the logos too? It looked different than normal embroidery. Uh, maybe some a little them, bit. Some, yeah. of them, some of them probably do, but not all of them because like okay. that grays is definitely not chain stitch. The flat yeah. ones do not, um, but the raised ones look like they do. Right, like I was looking at that stars and the Santuche, and I thought they looked. Wow, changed. you really butchered that, so. <laughs> dude. <laughs> Definitely got worse. It got worse. <laughs> I like these logos a lot. I just wish that it was done on a different on a different color cap. Now I think they did fix the brims though, so they're not the plasticky brim, from what I understand. Yeah, so good. Yeah, I got the last last run of the Abbott's fitted, and. It's actually a nice hat. Yeah. Did you All have right. the size up, or you got your? your no, I, I I bought my size. It fits fine. Okay. Cool. Listen, the first time around, Leon, every one of these fit perfectly for me. Mm -hmm. Remember, I bought the whole set. Yeah, yeah, that was last February. Every one of them fit right. You must have just gotten a bad hat. Oh, because all have one that didn't fit. I don't know. He keeps saying they have to size up or something. No, well, because uh, I have the unstructured Ebbets, and I feel like those you have to size up. The, this oh, is an Ebbets, scary. though. This is this is a replica of like this. Really, is a, a fifty nine fifty replica. Hmm. Right, they, co they, they co branded it though, right? This is an Ebbets release, or no? It's an Ebbets release, but this is a basically a fifty nine fifty clone. It's yeah. it's not the unstructured no. Ebbets believe... stuff. You're right. It's not the unstructured. It's this is their structured version, but I believe it's made by the same factory that was making their stuff before. Yes, correct. Yeah, lid stuff. Their their branded yeah. stuff. Mm -hmm. Yeah, they just took the Ebbets license, basically, and manufactured. And people are not. A lot of people aren't happy about. It, I'll tell you that right now. No, no, definitely not. Well, it's. I mean, Ebbets hats aren't made in the U.S. anymore. Mm -hmm. Well, they're, they're at least these. Model. At least these ones aren't. Their business model wasn't profitable. Well, sure. So, so it was either they don't exist at all, or they exist like this. So, yeah. all right, let's move on to locker room with Downey, guys. I, I really did like these, man. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Oof. See, like oh? this is a chrome dome I could go for. 
Milo doesn't like him. Do you like him, Milo? No, no I like that Angels a lot. Yeah. And the block. Oh, okay. And the block. Yeah. Ass. yeah. So. This picture is probably not the best version, the the one that they posted, but it is a good. It is a good. This is these are really good hats. If you go and check out the video we did on, and there's still some of these are still available. Actually, this is a better picture than the the ones they put on their website. Yeah. Vivi and Ivan, I think we need to up the production on those photos on the website a little bit because oh. your Instagram photos are great. Yeah. <clears throat> These are these are really good hats, man. They're really good. And the side patches on these are amazing. Leon put it best. The Angels has the best front, and then C Seattle and LA have the best side patches. Um, listen, we have 180 people in here right now. We only have 103 likes. Let's hit that like button, everybody. I'm uh, I'm hosting the show sick, so if that if that gets me any sympathy points, why don't you guys nope. hit that like button? We got Milo here too. We got Milo in here, so we should be liking the video for Milo. And Breeze back for the first time in 2023. So let's hit that like button, everybody, as we move along to my fitteds. Oof. They're on fire again, man. My fitted been doing some crazy shit, man. Ay, 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 ay. Milo, you liking anything here? Uh, this is my favorite guy right here, man. Um, I got that Mets hat coming tomorrow. You know, I'm from New York, so you know we got to mess with the beef and broccoli. The Royals hat is fire. Angels, fire. Phillies. I even want to tell you that the Boston hat's kind of fire, too. That Boston hat's good, man. It is. Which two would you drop here, Bree? Ooh. Drop. Maybe that socks. Um, where's the upper right? Okay. And then that Milwaukee Brewers underneath the Colorado Rockies. Okay. I draw those two. Jason, you like that Milwaukee Brewers, right? I do a lot. Yeah. I love the piping between the uh the front panel and the rest and the rest of the crown. Leon, well, what's your favorite hat in these slides besides the Jackie Robinson? <laughs> what you owe me forty bucks for? All right. All right. I'm just kidding, um, we'll take it off the tab. <laughs> Um, Her Hershey, uh, the a a AHL team. So I like how he did the Hershey Bears in the uh, Washington Capitals colorway. I think that was really cool. Yeah, that is a good hat. Jason, which two do you like the best? Um, kill them all, Mets, and yeah, hmm. There's like three that are tied for second, but I'll go with the Young Buck, Milwaukee, Milwaukee um, Brewers. Mm, okay. Yeah. Bree picked that as her weeper this week. Yeah. <laughs> she just doesn't like the chrome. She's anti chrome right now. Jack this is a, this is a classic, that. classic John Jay drop, though, right? Mm -hmm. He's killing it. Yeah, this is this is a good John. This is like solid, man. This is back to that. This harkens back to a different time for me. I felt like a few of his drops weren't as good, but this is back on it. And that LA hat, man, don't sleep on that thing. That thing is metallic out. The Dodgers hat. Mm. Colors are nice too. All right, let's move on to New Era cap. <laughs> so the Copa hats dropped this uh, week. A lot of the teams just recycled last year's version, so I just picked out some of the uh, newer designs uh, uh, for this year. Don't ask me which teams they are. <laughs> I don't know. Um, but yeah, Leon doesn't know what to think. I don't mind him. Uh, our cool friend uh, Jacobo worked on the bottom one to the le middle left, I guess. Oh, yeah, I see it. Yeah. Yeah. The llamas is cool. Yeah, the llama, I'll, the lower right, right? No, uh, middle right. Oh, no. I like the lower right. It looks like a goat or something. Mm -hmm. Yeah, he, that is like a crazy goat. Mm. But the llama, remember the original llama had the different color eyelets? So they got the yeah, 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 too. I remember. I'm probably going to have to pick that one up eventually. That's Corpus Christi up there with that little. Uh, 
Mm-hmm. Yeah, the guitar pick. That and mint one. Yeah. I don't know. Man. I think this whole this whole like thing is tired now, though, don't you? I'm... It's like so many teams signed up, so they just started just doing like random stuff, I feel like. Like the first couple ones were kind of like well and thought out, I feel like. Milo just yawned. <laughs> He's underwhelmed. underwhelmed. Let's move on to the next slide of New York cap. If those underwhelmed you, uh, you definitely should. Uh, What's it? It's the golf joints. Yeah. The Masters are coming is coming up. Next. Somebody, somebody told them Camo was hype and they didn't know what Camo. <laughs> so they invented their own. <laughs> Right, next slide. Uh, these I actually don't mind. It's so pointless, though. <laughs> it is like it's like let's just find a font and make some kind of like oh man, just whatever. Uh, at least they're gray bottom. Next. <laughs> Next. You don't want to celebrate the Astros 2022 World Series Championship Gold Program? That's the program, huh? Yeah. Yep. You got a black UV, right? Yep. <laughs> Even their Leon, just caps Leon. is getting lazy. Leon, you like Woody's? Do you like that Woody's hat here? <laughs> no. That Oakland is cool, though, right? It's okay. And... What? It looks like the script is is sagging. I like it. I like that open one. You like the Rays? I like the logo. I just don't like that color. Like, yeah. I don't I know. Durham might be the best. <sighs> These are all a pass. You don't like the what is it? Nope. Tacoma? Nope. <laughs> no, that that's rough. That's rough. The Yankees looks like it fell off like the Alpha Industries order. Hmm. And then you got okay. a random Cascadian LA logo in there for some reason. Is that contrast stitching on the bill? Yep. Oh, never mind. <laughs> <laughs> That's actually one of the coolest parts of this this whole thing. You don't think, like contrast stitching, Bree? It it depends. I think like with the because the one I was leaning towards was the Tacoma one, but I feel like if that had been like it looks like it's navy, so if it was solid navy, I think it would look a little better. Yeah, all of them have it. You don't see it as clear on the orange, but orange has it too. It looks like I mean, but like the last eight just caps drops have all been the same, just switch the colorway, right? Just apply, yeah, yeah, but that's them, man. Oh. Four matches. Boring. Let's go to the last slide, if that's okay, guys. At least something decent here. New Jackie Robinson patch. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Black unders. Yep. And this will probably be that liquid plastic chrome. Cr- liquid chrome. Yeah. Ugh. Blech. You just apply the patch to old stock. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> that's, that's what they do, man. Yeah. 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 I mean, he's good a new Jackie patch. You know, we've had the yeah. same one for like three years, I feel like. What were you going to say, Bree? I, I was going to say, I follow Hat Crawler on Twitter. <laughs> and so, like, when there's these big drops like this, like, it's like 50 straight tweets of, like, mm-hmm. just, like, Jackie Robinson uh, things. And I'm like, oh, new Jackie hats are up. <laughs> mm-hmm. Yep. And if you that's because lids. That's because lids will drop them like an hour before New York cap yeah, too. So yeah. like, uh, you get them twice. Yeah. All right. So let's move on to uh, Noble North. Noble North had a pretty cool. Mm. So Milo, I didn't get to ask you during the clink room slide. Do you do you get down with these sorts of hats, or are you just like strictly the team clink, hat the, guy? The clink room stuff. I like the 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 logos that come out, but the the colorways is usually. A- Problem for me, it's a little bit too funky for me. But this one right here, I actually like a lot. I like this hat a lot. Yeah. Mm-hmm. For you, like this hat? I actually, I do like this hat. It's I pretty cool, like man. It. 
Yeah. Leon, you like this, right? Yeah, it's cool. Yeah. He's he, he's doing really good stuff. He doesn't miss too often. No. All right. Leon, I'm in I'm in need of a bio break. Can you take us to yeah. Pro Image? No problem. All right. Pro Image 805. Um looks like they have a couple Dodgers hats here. Brooklyn Dodgers with the metallic. Um 60th anniversary. 50th anniversary and Dodger Stadium. I believe the one in the bottom left hand corner is like hooked to one of their signs, I think. Like in Dodger Stadium. Um but yeah. You guys yeah. fill in the, the top? Oh yeah, super, for sure. Super metallic out. I love that top row. Mm-hmm. Top is nice. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. It gives That's very cool. classy. Yeah. Bottom right, I feel like we've seen before. Kind of yeah, that red, looks like, kind of like a um God, what was that colorway? Louis V, right? Yeah, Louis V. There you go. Louis V. And even Lids did a big black red drop too. Yeah, yeah. Right after. Um Nothing different, but I mean, if you don't have it by now, cool, maybe. Yeah. That Jackie was fantastic. Unfortunately, the half never made it online. Mm. Damn. Yeah. Pretty cool. All right. 818. Bunch of LA again. Anything stick out here for you guys? Nope. <laughs> I have the Dodger script on the bottom right. It's okay. It's different, right? Yeah. I'm, that one, that one to the left middle is kind of weirding me out. Yellow button, red eyelets, black like red. A, it's got to be like, some sort of hook or something. Yeah. yeah, these. I don't remember what these are hooked to. I didn't pay enough attention. Yeah. Bottom left ain't bad. Uh, the metallic visor. I'm not uh, a fan it's of metallic. Or is I it think a white so. Or, or white. Yeah, either way. Rough, yeah. This is the Ch- uh, Chavo Del 8 pack. Chavo I have, Del 8. So you explain that, and I still <laughs> it still means nothing to me. It, it, it's more confusing. <laughs> yeah. Can you... Can you uh, uh, there's... It, I'm not familiar, but there's... The Panama Tan one is El Chavo. The black crown with the scarlet brim is... Uh, and I'm going to butcher these. I'm sorry. Uh, yeah, I, w- I would just want to hear you say more Spanish words. <laughs> Quinto, the chrome white with a scarlet brim is no, no. Uh, and I'm really going to mess this one up. Chrome white with the Kelly green is Chilindrina. The gray crown with the navy blue brim is the Don Ramon. And then the black crown with the chrome white brim is Senor Bar- Baragas. Okay. Can I ask you a question? Yeah. If, we have, if we have Milo here, why, why are you trying this? <laughs> Right, right. Because <laughs> Milo doesn't have the Instagram pulled up. Uh, no, th- um, it's just it's just it's just fun to hear style butcher these and offend our entire <laughs> Spanish speaking audience. <laughs> Listen, Apparently, it's a Spanish. Bad hat. Did you guys say these were bad? No, I, I just said it's. I don't know. It wasn't doing it for me. I like lower left. I like the middle right. I like the top one. I think there's some good ones here. It's a Mexican show. Okay. El Chavo, Del Ocho. Cool. All right. They style a really nice job with that. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> I do I do apologize to anyone that I offended for my horrible pronunciations. <laughs> Blanket brims is uh <laughs> stitching on us. All right, Pro Image America. These are the MP4 pack, I believe. Um we got another future dirty sprite, Biggie, Kanye again. Um, and then the bottom three, I don't remember what the hooks are for those. But San Francisco was a was an MP4 pack as well. Okay, cool. Yeah, probably yeah, like Larry, Larry June. June. Larry June, I'm assuming, maybe. <sighs> I don't know. Yeah. And then uh Jackie Robinson, um, 75th, color differently, and then the LA uh stone in green. That was a hook to something. I don't remember what. What's up? Is Rose, that Rose Bowl? Biggie Rose Bowl? Uh, yeah. Big E hook on the Brooklyn. Yep. Ready to die. I don't like the color on that Brooklyn dot, that Jackie patch at oh. all. It looks like a Crayola crayon box. I was mm-hmm. about to say that Jackie is colored a little differently. Like, 
I don't know what the goal was. I'll do the right thing, Brooklyn. That makes sense. Uh, that that makes, makes sense. Idea. Okay. Okay. That does make sense. Um, still don't like it though. I like the MyFitness one. Just just plain colors, Brooklyn. Nice and easy. Mm-hmm. No, but I get the hook. Do the right thing. That's that's the that's the colors from the from the movie poster. The movie, yeah. And he's wearing the Jackie Robinson jersey. Yeah. Movie, almost. Yep. All right, let's move on to Promish Colorado. All right. These were the boy who loves New Era pack. Um Chicago Cubs. <laughs> Uh, Wrigley Field <laughs> patch was the first time we've seen it. Um, but, yeah, navy and gray, solid all around, I think. We did a review. Uh, if you guys want to check out our extended uh, review of these, check out the video. But, uh, Bree, are you feeling these? I I like the Cubs. That Rockies, there's something with the – with the coloring on that, it's just like a little off on the front mm-hmm. part. But I, I mean, overall, mm-hmm. I like—I really like navy blue. So I mean, I think they're yeah. okay. Yeah, like they have like this uh, this policy that you got to do a Colorado hat. So I always like picturing them making them like, and then being told they have to do a Colorado hat, <laughs> and then rolling their eyes. Um, but it always seems like the Colorado ones get like the least love. Yeah, we'll out of there. Um, okay, all right. DPM. All right, let's do it. What is this? Is that a lavender button? Uh, yes. What color is the UV? Uh, Probably uh, gray, uh, maybe. I don't know. It's like a big chicken nugget hat. <laughs> what? Is this what, a, like a chicken nugget? What, what is this? No. Dreamers pack. Dreamers pack. A hat is inspired by one of the most influential African American dreamers. Martin Luther King? Yeah, sounds like it. Is this a two tone? Yeah, it is a two tone. Mm hmm. Trying to see if I can. They don't really show a picture of the UV. Yeah. Trying to find it. I wonder what the tie into that is, though. Uh, it looks like the UV is lavender as well. Mm. Mm. Oh, yeah. It's like almost like a slate. It's not quite lavender. I don't know. It's weird. All right. Well, we'll circle back to this when we figure it out. Let's move on to Pro. <laughs> <laughs> What the hell? Uh, so the top row is a hot dog hook of some sort, and hot the uh, bottom row is called Rocket Man. All right, a lot of uh, oh, I'm uh, Michigan, Rah- Rahib Ishmael. I'm guessing. Oh, okay, okay, you have Rocket Man. Yeah, well, yeah, so you're gonna do all you're gonna do like a Cleveland, a Detroit, an <sighs> athletics, and a Pittsburgh hat. In honor of – listen, I want to – let's talk about how much of a stretch this is, right? All right, man. Rocket that, Ishmael, right? Like yeah. We're gonna that, do I, that's what I'm saying the Rocket Man is. It may not actually be what it is. But so he played in blue. Morgan. Oh. Which one played at Michigan? I thought one of them played Michigan. Never mind. <laughs> He's like, scratch that. It's yep. not him. It's definitely. It, not it him, does though. look like a Michigan hook, though. Um, Navy it does. Names, right? Yeah, but, but why though? Like, I mean, god damn, these are so like. They're not in good colorways, man. Well, if you take the Detroit out, the bottom one spells cap. <laughs> Maybe that's got something to do with it. <clears throat> it shouldn't be a jigsaw puzzle, but I mean, the Detroit <laughs> makes sense. U of M's there, right? Okay, cool. Oh, man. The, the top row man. is like hot dog hats. Like seriously, man. Like I mean, that's what they called it. It could be a hot dog. Could be an innuendo for something else. I don't know. Means they don't put catchy. anything on their Instagram. So Leon, you're the resident pervert. What could that mean? <laughs> I mean, it's a hot dog hat. I I see yellow writing. It could green, be a sabrette, sabrette or. Yeah. Ketchup mustard relish? I don't know, but the, come on, man. What are we doing here? 
What are we doing? Shoe Palace. Jason and I already looked at these. What are your thoughts on these, Milo? What are you thinking? I mean, I'm, <laughs> I'm all set on those. Thank you. <laughs> that was so polite. How about you, Bree? You liking these? So, as a fam, you alone, you know, anything orange and green, I'm like, let me see what I can do with it. I just feel like the gray, um, that just sort of kind of ruined the orange and green for me. So, <laughs> I'm going to let these go. And also, is Shoe Palace one of those places that doesn't shop, I mean, stock higher than five eighths? Not online, they don't. Yeah, and so I'm a 3-4, so I just sort of kind of don't pay them any attention. I think in store they might have some. Okay. That's what I've heard. Yeah, unfortunately, so mm. I can never sh really shop there. All right, well, let's move on to sneaker politics. They have size 7 3 quarters. <laughs> <laughs> I like a lot of what they do. This one I wasn't liking that much. It almost reminds me of like a Bel Air. Type like Fresh Prince colorway. Yeah, it could be. They didn't. I didn't see anything on on this one. Mm -hmm. There's something about the colors. I'm just not liking this one. Uh, this is a super soaker hook. Mm. Okay. A Birmingham local invented it in 1989. The prototype. Oh, that's all right. Well, at least there's some thought put into it. That's good. Yeah. I'm still not a huge. I'm still not a huge. Uh, huge fan of it, though. Mm -mm. These are good. I was supposed to get this pack to 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 do a video on. I don't know if, if it's lost in transit, but. <laughs> One of these is Venom, right? Doctor Doom. Spider-Man. And I'm not sure who this guy is down here. Unless it's like X-Men. X-Men. Oh, X-Men. Or Avenger. Because you have the cross. Well, this is Avenger, Avengers over here. So Avengers versus X-Men. Yeah. Who's the Rays? Is it, like the Rays is not. It's just the other way. So the first four are part of their Marvel, mm -hmm. uh, looks like, pinball pack. Maybe Marvel versus Capcom, the fight, the fighting game. That's what it is. That's what it is. That's what it is. People are saying Black Panther? Which one? Uh, Oakland. No. Oh, okay. well, they were in Oakland, though, before. Um, that's where... Uh, what's his name? Michael B. Jordan's dad in the movie was raised was in Oakland. That's mm -hmm. right. That's right. I remember that. The Stomp Stompers doing the Wakanda Forever sign too. So. Mm. Okay. Cool. That makes sense. The Yankees had a weird choice though, considering like Spider Man's from Queens. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Well. Let's move on to Sports World 165. Wow. Yeah. They've really fallen off. <laughs> Look at that Seattle in the bottom middle, man. Yeah. Or the, the Cardinals next to it. Mm. Dodgers. I'm telling you. Dodgers is bro. It's got to be a fight to see who's the worst one, right? <laughs> Okay, we get it. It's Black Panther. None of us saw the live, all right? Because they can't tag the creator, so we didn't see it. Jesus. We are allowed to be wrong once in a while. Sorry, I'm just sharing, just sharing. But these are... Uh, like... Oh, God, let's go to still. Someone said drop eight. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, easy. <clears throat> One of these is the weekend, right? In the upper left. Montreal. 
mean, he always does clean, simple stuff. Mm -hmm. Milo, anything you're liking here? I love the Montreal. I love that when they do that, like uh, kind of like smooth logo. Yeah, like green. Yeah, I like yeah. The, like the I like the Blue Jays. I like the top how it's uh, that metallic gold. Yeah. Mm. Yeah, nice. How about you, Bree? Anything you like in there? I've always I like the toothpaste teeth. At the bottom. Yeah. All right, let's move on to Team Collective. Nice job, Shaheen. Really mm -hmm. nice job, as always. Yeah. Our, our our second Titanic inspired hat of the, the show. Dude, what the fuck is this, man? Holy shit, man. Uh, Phil Hauser's. Yeah. Phil did this? Yep. It takes a rare hat company that can mess up Phil Hauser's designs. I mean, I mean, he just took his art and put it on, right? Uh, <laughs> I love Phil Hauser too, but I, I'm I'm not gonna say nothing. I'm I'm gonna I'm gonna bite my tongue here. Does the iceberg have a face on it? It does. Yeah, it's sinking the Titanic. I still think. I mean, it happened in what 1912. I still think it's too soon to be doing. Like, let's commemorate a lot of people dying. Hats. <laughs> oh, so hey, we gotta get that Hindenburg inspired hat away from. <laughs> Yeah. Away from Leon. Pause, pause production on that one. Mm -hmm. All right, let's go on a topper store. All right. Let's play a little keep three, drop three. So we don't lose our momentum here. I'm going to start with you, Milo. Keep three, drop three. Keep the Orioles. I like that Astros logo because it reminds me of reading Rainbow. <laughs> uh. <laughs> <laughs> Who's the swinging bear? Was that was a minor league team? Oh, yeah, Denver. Denver, Denver Bears. Denver, yeah. Yeah, I'll go with that. I like that. And then drop three. Yeah. Um, drop that Phillies. The Conks. Or conch. Conk? Conk. Oh, now we got to teach you in English. Uh, like <laughs> no, because. <laughs> oh, how the turn on the table. <laughs> 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 Drop the conks, the Phillies, and that that Mets hat for sure. Hmm. Okay. All right. Jason, keep three, drop three. Oh, I get a play. Sweet. I'm gonna keep the Cleveland. I'm gonna keep Baltimore. And I'm gonna keep the um Astros. Okay. Uh I'm going to drop the Phillies. Uh I don't need a hat on my hat. <laughs> uh, I'm I'm going to drop the conks too. Uh, normally, I like that logo. I just I'm not a fan of that colorway. And I'm going to drop um, that bottom middle Mariners. There's just okay. something off about it. Don't know what it is. I Maybe mean, it's the green right. on green. Mm -hmm. Fair enough. Leon W Chen. I'm keeping the Mariners top a uh, bottom left. I'm keeping the Salt Lake Gulls, and I'm keeping the St. Louis Cardinals bottom right. I'm dropping the Mariners. I'm dropping the Phillies because it's a poop patch, but it's a brown hat, so it's a bad choice. <laughs> and I will drop the Mariners top right. I've never liked that Mariners logo. I mean, sorry, the Marlins logo. I've never liked the Marlins, so top right's getting dropped. All right. Bree, you're up. I'm keeping that Orioles. I love that hat. Um, I like the Oakland Athletics, that A. Um, I like how metallic that I, that is. And then I'll probably keep the Guardians. And then I'm dropping the Marlins, um, that Phillies, and then probably that Mariners in the bottom middle as well. Style, I'm gonna allow you to play. Okay, I'm going to keep that emo Cardinals. No, you I'm do. <laughs> I like that thing. I'm gonna keep the A's, and I'm gonna keep the bottom left Mariners. Now, and those I'm are three very white choices, and <laughs> the exact same choices Leon made. 
<laughs> and I'm going to drop choices. Going to drop the Salt Lake. I'm dropping the Mets. And I'm going to drop the Angels in the top left. That angel in the top left is beautiful. Not a fan. Obviously not. You dropped it. <laughs> <laughs> Let's move on to uniform sports. These are like Mardi Gras pack. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Any thoughts here, guys? Leon? None at all. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> my, my, yeah, you couldn't my even wait. I already called on him. He's saying yeah, no. Yeah. Nope, nope. Got a got a rep for the New Orleans. So I just feel like if you do Mardi Gras, you got to do New Orleans in some way, shape, or fashion. But I guess like for the hook wise, the prototype's the best one. But the rest of them don't like really feel. The Mariners one does. Come on. Uh, okay, I'll give you I that. Like the Pirates. I like this colorway. So there was supposed to be a New Orleans, but it was rejected. They would reject it. They would because it was too obvious, you know? Yeah. I don't know. The, 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 the places don't remind me of New Orleans. Like, I don't. Who cares? Yeah. The LA, I bet that looks really nice in hand with a metallic green in the front. Like you take away all the the necklace and the whatever on the bottom, and you just take the hat. Who cares if it's Mardi Gras or not? Right. It's a good looking color. Like, yeah, to not to everybody, I but yeah, I mean, it's I not bad to me that. either. But I think like you know, everyone's gonna have their like Milo is definitely yeah. like he he wasn't even called upon, and he said nah. <laughs> Some people well, don't like no, it. No, I I get it, but like to. Discount it because the cities don't feel Mardi Gras enough. Like, I don't know. I I don't get that. Like, but that's the hook, though. Like, that's I know. But like, if the hat is still good, regardless what the hook is, like, does it matter what the hook is? That's my point. Sure. Yeah. I don't want to end the show with an argument. Let's move on to USA Cap. Game. I'm not. I'm not arguing. No, I mean, I'm, everyone because I'm right. right. It's not an argument when I'm right. Well, uh, you, can think, you can think that, but I don't know. These three uh, hats came out from USA Cap King. Um, mm-hmm. Solid hats. I mean, I'm, I'm not sure if I like that um, that stomper, but I do like the other two. Any thoughts here, Milo? You like any of these three hats? Definitely the stomper has got to go. The other two are okay. I don't know. Queen's got to do better, man, from Queen's. All, all the Queen's miles suck right now. I'm being honest. I think USA Cap King is the best of the three, though. Yeah, I agree. They do the cleaner. They do the cleaner stuff. Sure. And T dot snap is uh snap is at a casino or something. Which is probably code for jail. <laughs> <laughs> well, he was he was talking on here for a little bit, right? Yeah. Oh, that's before they confiscated his phone. <laughs> well, why don't we pull this down, fellas? And Bree, sorry, Bree. It's okay. It's a force of habit. I'm sorry. So, listen, I think this is a pretty good show. Milo, did you enjoy your time here? Yes, very much so. Thank you very much for having me. And Milo will also be present for Keepers, Sleepers, and Weepers, which we're going to film directly after this. Bree, it was fantastic having you on again. I think Thanks the dog fell asleep, me. right? The dog fell asleep. Yeah, he's he's like passed out, laying on his back down here. That's awesome, man. That's awesome. And uh, Jason Mead is just getting started. Look at him; he's all frisky and wired up. Look at him! Look at him! He fired the fuck up. What? Leon? I wasn't even paying Leon, attention. Leon's only three tube socks into his day, so he's got some more. Uh, <laughs> some more <laughs> That's gross. <laughs> got some more friction to create. <laughs> some more day to go and uh style you did like your normal mediocre mediocre <laughs> sort of like meandering around the 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 control board i mean it was hey, pretty good you know what i got off to a slow start but i picked it up in the latter half nah half you did all right you, did <laughs> you had like one good slide like so Jason, what i want 
style my vision right my vision is to never pay you but you to get better at this so okay. <laughs> so like what i'm looking to do here right is like i'm gonna i'm gonna set a goal for you now okay can i set a goal for you or no let's do it all right so first i want to make sure that we're clear on this you will never get paid more than you are today okay, okay? i want to be clear doesn't matter what goes on you'll never be paid more than that. <laughs> never what size hat are you i'm a five eighth I will, I'm going to get you a hat, though. That's for sure. I'm okay. going to get you a card. That, that's on me. I'm going to make sure you get some Cardinals hats, some Cardinals hats. But what I expect from now on is at least 10 polls per show. Okay. At least 20 highlighted comments of quality. Oh, it's got to be more than that. What do you want? We have, like 50, we have like 50, 60 slides. It, it shouldn't be unreasonable to have one highlighted comment per slide. I got to tell you, that's a very reasonable request, actually. Okay. That, that sounds very reasonable. So. So, what do we say? We said ten polls. I I think I was pretty close to ten tonight. I was right around there. Leon is, is Leon. You like polls? Is is ten polls like <laughs> adequate? <laughs> adequate number. <laughs> you getting mad? I'm getting <laughs> through. All right, I'm cool so, you come, right? I'm, you keep going. Leon, how many how many polls do you think you should have to do? Ten seems fair, minimum. What do you think, Leon? We're trying. We're in the spirit of challenge ten, here. You think ten, ten polls in, in two hours? That's a lot of pole dancing. <laughs> you haven't seen me in my heyday. <laughs> All right, so Pause. fifteen. So it's settled. Fifteen polls, and one comment per slide. Okay. Easy work. That's gonna be some work, right? Easy. You know what? Easy I'm work. I'm gonna be practicing these next couple weeks. I'm gonna do some training. Mm -hmm. <laughs> gonna hit the weight room a little bit, you know. Make sure I get my finger exercises in. I'll be good. We don't to go. need you developing carpal tunnel, so take it easy. <laughs> yeah. But uh, listen, guys, this was really fun. I really appreciate all of our uh, viewers for being with us this entire night. We appreciate you. I appreciate you, Milo, for joining us, and uh, Bree, as always. Thank you for joining us. And Milo, this won't be your last time on the show. We're gonna have you back for sure if you'd ever want to come back. It'd be you amazing. Know. I appreciate that. You did an amazing job, and you're wearing a fantastic custom hat. Thank you, thank you. <clears throat> now, with that, Leon, big fella, take us away. Yeah, make sure you guys are dropping a like on the video. Views from the vault.com and get your official merch from us. For Jason, Leon, Pierre, Style, Bree, and Milo, we're signing out, guys. Stay fitted. See you, everybody.